slow motion for me. Don't yeah. even throw no potion for me. Mm. Berserk, go and come out. I don't even know what else to do, but I know he's gonna shout. <laughs> Tired of waiting to see the next episode reaction? Why not join the Patreon? You can gain access to reactions that have been uploaded weeks in advance before they land on YouTube. Most of all, you can watch the full-length versions without the annoying copyright filter and subpar audio for just $5 a month. If you want to take your loyalty even further, you can watch our non-animated related reactions as well as submit requests for just $10 a month. So stay ahead of the curve and help us sustain the brand. Thank, Thank you. you. Yo, what's going on you guys? It's your boy RBG, aka the Random Black Gamer, here with my lovely and sexy wife Johnny Lee on the ones and twos, and this is We Ain't Seen Reactions, the place where we react to everything that we've never seen, and the answer lies in the heart of a reaction. Got my new rag just as on y'all, I'm ready to go, because we're getting to more and more details regarding some of these damn characters, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't gonna lie, the last episode where we reacted to of Fate Stay Night, it just kind of like revealed a lot to me and it was all in the form of one move which is my girl Sabre's Noble Phantasm, the Excalibur. The Excalibur, man. Like is this chick, is she some kind of Arthurian knight or something like that? What's going on with her? She's kind of keeping a lot secret, you know what I'm saying? A lot of stuff secret that I think Shiro would really benefit from knowing, man. What did you yeah. think of this episode? Let us know what's up. Was pretty cool you know i said i thought she was joan park at first um that's who i thought she was mm. but i don't know who she is but i mean that move i mean it took a lot out of her it did she blew all what's the call away because uh well shit rider had so many damn pegasus exactly living up to a true name man you know what she i'm saying was a rider of a damn pegasus but boy that pegasus it had to fly away. Yeah, it couldn't withstand this, man. But let's take it back to the episode before that because we got a chance to see Saber go up against the samurai assassin dude that was over there at the temple. She was finna go to town. She was. Until they realized they was being watched. Not only that, but, you know, she like she was trying to bluff, like she was going to do her move. But for some reason, she held I back. Don't think she but had this second that. episode after that kind of provides a little more context to why she held back because that is one of the most devastating moves. And if it weren't for her having higher ground, like she mentioned, she probably would have leveled out the whole city. Right. And if you think about all those details about her being reluctant to cause all that, like you know that <clears throat> that that damage, you know that collateral damage. Mm -hmm. Who were the first two warriors we saw at the beginning in the first episode where Shinji was like in that city? It was her and Archer, right? And wasn't she doing a similar attack? And then the city get leveled out? So what if she was the person that leveled out the fucking city? I mean, she probably was, you know what I'm saying? That move didn't look like he came to play with anybody. It didn't, and she was reluctant to do it. So I think she's, you know, she's she's not, you no know, letting Shiro, Shiro in on something. How like, strong she is. I think she remembers leveling that, that city like that when I'm she was fighting sure Archer. I wonder if they always remember all of their battles or all of their um, whatever these are called. Right. You know, it's almost like destinies are intertwined with her and Shiro and maybe that's going to be something that's revealed or maybe that's right, not what yeah, I think like, it is. Maybe she did and she doesn't want to tell Shiro because that's how he ended up being an orphan. I don't know. Yeah, because she's going, it seems like she's going along with his philosophy now of just saving as many people as possible without just, you know, Letting them get caught in the crossfire. But we'll just have to see, man. That's just me kind of spitballing all my <coughs> different theories and stuff based off of that one attack, which is something very strong. And I think she's going to kind of be out for a while. So let's go ahead and jump into this, guys. This is going to be episode 13. So let's get it. Judging from her condition, I doubt she'll be waking up anytime soon. Shit. Destroy it. It's a good thing you were here, Tosaka. I didn't have anything to do with this. Saber's condition isn't getting better, Shiro. Would you mind explaining what happened? Well, we took out Ryder. I still can't believe it. Saber used her noble phantasm. The men when it was over, she collapsed. Hmm. She used her noble phantasm, huh? You're lucky. I'm going to be nice and not grill you on the specifics of Saber's power. Really? As it is, you two have a much bigger problem to worry about right now. What are you talking about? The thought should have at least crossed your mind. If you don't figure something out quick, Saber is going to disappear. Really? Disappear? Just because of that one move? Gone. She has hardly anything left. 
I have no idea what kind of noble phantasm she used last night, but whatever it was, it all but depleted the mana she has. Servants are essentially spiritual entities. They can't exist in the physical realm without mana. If she uses her noble phantasm, she'll disappear for sure. All right, fine. And I'll Man, she just needs to refrain from using it. No servant can survive the Holy Grail Wars without their noble phantasm, Shiro. Really? Really. Yeah, I would have thought of the same bonehead idea. Okay. I mean, there's nothing using it. How's she gonna win? How's she gonna win? <laughs> the other is less attractive. Mm. It requires forcing the servant to replenish their mana on their own. Are you talking about doing what Ryder did? You want Saber to build her Better strength a few back people. by ripping the souls out of innocent people? That's ridiculous. Rip the souls out of people who ain't shit. To do something right. like that. No, she probably wouldn't. Well then, can Murderers, you think of a way that allows you to provide her with the mana she needs? Mm -hmm. No, Eat of them. course not. If I could do that, I would have done it already. Unfortunately, I don't have that kind of power. The only thing you can do to save Saber is to use a command seal and force her to attack someone. <sighs> you mean to kill innocent people? It's your only way of avoiding the worst case scenario. If you don't want to lose Saber, then use a command seal. But I can't do that. What do I do? Is that really the only way to save you? Well, if this is Chicago, I'll be having all kind of ops getting attacked by Saber, man. <laughs> Is that her when she was young? I bring her to school with me if I was still in school, so people would stop bullying me. Mm. The chosen one. Take your final step and grab your legacy. I wonder if she already had the power of all that power just within. Whosoever pulleth this sword from this stone shall be the rightful king of all Britain. Mm. Before you attempt this, Arturia, I suggest you give great thought in regards to what you're about to commit to. Arturia. Once you take that sword in hand, there's no returning. We'll see about that. I know. It's gonna be a weapon. I have come here to free this sword on my own volition. Is that supposed to be Merlin over there? Or Moylan? I mean, she doesn't want to be classified as a he or a she, I think. That's Saber. How does he see that? That's not the same sword she used last night. How come she doesn't have that sword now? Really? I thought it was the same sword. Um, I can't see. Yes, nigga. What do you want, huh? I won't answer questions, even about archery. Well, good, because as it turns out, I could care less about that damn bow. Damn. I just thought I'd stop by and see what you were up to, that's all. So every time I hear these niggas talk to each other, I can't clearly help but think about Vax and uh, Scanlan now. I finally recovered from the injuries I really received from like Saber. Me. But I doubt I will be kept on watch duty much longer. A servant summoned by a master who can't replenish their mana has no chance of survival. She knew all along this would happen. Sure. Think what you want. I'm not gonna let Saber disappear. Mm. Obviously, I need to spell this out for you. Saber must have known that if she used her noble phantasm, she would disappear. Knowing the outcome, she had probably intended never to use it. That's the there thing. There can only be one reason she called up her noble phantasm. She wants Saber to be gone. Saber decided to protect you rather than protect herself. You should never forget that. <laughs> Archer has such a bad attitude. He do, but he be spitting it real though. He do, but because there's a, a a certain reluctancy that Saber has, and it seems like she doesn't even want to be here for some reason. Like she's just would rather exhaust whatever mana she got. The other masters and bring the holy. She'd probably be the most today. destructive one. I have to have Saber with me. I didn't expect you to be here. Elia, 
Get your hands off my knee like that, girl. Wait, hold on. I'm sorry, Elia, but I don't have time to play with you today. Saber's about to fade away, isn't she? Wow. Elia. She know what's up, man. She's probably ready to kill she this nigga. The reason Ryder's master got away is because you're always so nice. <laughs> Are you on top of that building last night, too? I think she was. Or she was there. Oh my you god, bro. Oh, do you? I didn't think I'd be able to catch you this easily. You're so cute. I was thinking that. I'm like, girl, I would have told her to get up off me. It's just a waste of time, okay? The sleep paralysis demon. Kill me. Some of that new delta right there. Saber's going to be gone for us soon. Integrity. Integrity way. See, she's just been watching from afar just to pick the right time to take him out. I mean, because he just... Not necessarily his fault, but he's so ignorant to all of this stuff. And he is too nice. The sword of Siegfried. Where the hell am I? Last thing I remember, Ilya had paralyzed me. And then. The daycare center of death. Wait. That bed look cold. What the hell is it going do. on? If I don't get home soon, Saber's gonna. So, you finally decided to wake up. How are you feeling? You should be able to talk again by now. Oh yeah, I'm feeling great. I've recovered enough presence of mind to realize that you've gone and made me your prisoner. What's wrong? Are you mad now? I did you a favor. Captured enemies are supposed to be thrown into the dungeon, you know. But I decided to make an exception. But you could just you off me at any time. No, the girls put me out of my misery. I don't want to talk to you. Torture me by making me listen to kids' bop music or something. No one is gonna interfere. What this bitch on, man? Did you even bother bringing me here? If you're planning to kill me, you could have easily done that back at the park. Alright, I'll ask you this one more time. What do you say? Come on, be my servant, Shiro. <sighs> boy. This girl's delusional. I'm sorry. I still have Saber as my servant. And as long as that's true, I'm gonna keep being a master. I see. So that's how you are. You're just gonna betray me, too. I've been turning a blind eye to you lately, but that's over now. Wait here. Hold on, Ilya. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna go kill Saber. <laughs> oh my gosh, she say this shit. Don't. Saber and so calmly. To do with this. The reasons I can't see what I don't think he personal. understands. He's, it's like he still, yeah. still don't understand how this works. Yeah. I'm still gonna kill him. And once they're gone, I'll come back for you. You see, if you don't wanna be mine, then I'm afraid I just don't have any use for you. If you wanna hate me, fine. But there's no reason for you to kill Saber and Tosaka. Shiro, I can't go letting the other masters live. These are the Grail Wars, remember? Damn it, Ilya. Don't talk about killing people like it's nothing. But it's not that big of a deal. In case you didn't know this, I've already killed one master. Uh, you did? Yeah, what did you kill? yesterday. It was kind of unexpected. I didn't plan it or anything. Was it Sinji? I thought for sure you would have finished him off yourself. Oh my god! You didn't. Oh, damn. Well, I mean, I can't feel bad for you. I can't either, but damn, I didn't think he was worth killing if he lost his. <laughs> mm, come here, boy. That booyah. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> Why are we laughing? I don't know. Shit. I hope you're not upset. I only killed him because you didn't. To tell you the truth. I kind of feel bad whenever I steal prey from somebody else. <laughs> this woman is a mess, or this girl, woman, child, I don't even know. Crazy. Crazy. Ilya, wait. Ilya. Damn it, Ilya, get back here. Ilya, you can tell she's just evil. She's got them red eyes. She really means it. What are you finna do? Damn it. 
That brat! I'm still feeling the effects of that evil eye she used on me. All right. It won't be pretty, but I'll use mana to flush it out. Trace on. Here you go. Reduce the integrity of those ropes. Established. Components determined. The mana's being generated really quickly. It must be because of that gem Tosaka made me swallow. Mm. <laughs> You do this, man. You gotta focus. Try not to use that I much think I EX. I hear him reinforce objects. I don't hear him reduce like the yeah. integrity of them. Yeah, the structural integrity. It's a cute little bear. I'm almost there. Wait, bleeding and whatnot. What? better <sighs> all right guys that was episode 13 titled winter castle mm. man this boy always getting himself caught up it's almost like it's painting a picture that he cannot be too far he can't stray too far away from um saber like that because things man, always... he be messing up even when he right there with saber i just it's but, like yeah. his ignorance of how stuff actually works kind of messes him over and even sometimes when he do know how stuff works he just makes the boneheaded decision to just i don't know yeah he's always getting caught up you know and i don't think he ever thinks to have his guard up when he meets these other warriors or masters or mages or whatever you want to call right them. that's the thing it's like i don't think he understands that it's like okay even if you're cool with somebody i think because he's gotten so close to tokasa mm -hmm. he didn't got so close to her he just think oh yeah it'll all be great and i guess he had a bonding moment with old girl the other day yeah and he think oh it's all good no it's like bro when you see these people your guard needs to be up period. at all times man you gotta make sure that you be on your p's and q's because and it seems like everybody has their own approach you know shinji uh, Shinji had his approach, you know, he wanted to be friendly and be like, hey, I don't want to fight you. I just want you to join me. Well, we saw that Shinji is just a backstabbing bitch. Yeah, it's like in his case, he doesn't understand. It's like he's at a disadvantage because not only does he not have any idea what's going on, he's also unfortunately the weakest one, especially now that Shinji is gone. He's certainly seemingly the weakest one. Mm -hmm. So it's like, hey, man, you need to kind of, you know, make sure that you are on your guard you always need to have Saber with you, or you need to be near Saber, or you need to just be at home. Yeah, if I was him, I would have just stayed back at the crib That's and mastered my ability that uh, Rin was trying to teach me to master. Yeah, I would have did that, or I would have just stayed at home and tried to figure something out. What was the point in going and sitting on the park bench? Yeah. But anyway. But, yeah, that dream, though, I have a feeling that, that dream is an integral part. Yeah, I feel like it's going to lead him to that sword and lead him to... His yeah, because oh. it looked like it was in the bushes somewhere, like somewhere in the woods, and I'm pretty yeah. sure he's going to come across it because he says that, oh, yeah, I would like to wield that sword or something like that. And, you know, that's pretty much foreshadowing of what's to come in the later episodes where he's going to actually use it to, I guess, fully recharge Saber's mana or whatever. Something or... I was like, maybe he could take her place. I don't know what he's going to do. Yeah, but this next fight seems like it's going to be between the Berserker and my boy Archer. I, I want to see what Archer is going to do, you know? Um, but I feel like I give this episode, I give it an A. Yeah, I give it an A+. Plus. It was a <coughs> pretty enjoyable mm -hmm. episode, you know what I'm saying? It showed a little bit of what Sabre was, who she was, you know? So, yeah, man, we're going to go ahead and keep it moving with episode 14. So, let's get into it. It's going to be called The End of the Ideal. He is all. You're absolutely certain that he's in there. I don't believe it. You've lost your mind. <laughs> I assume you haven't forgotten the pawn that she controls. Yeah. That nigga gonna be a problem. He gonna be beating up Whatever the bass on this audio too. 
For any servant, her master. Any... Quiet! You need to hide yourself, Archer. You should mask yourself too. Hey, yeah. Uh huh. Boy. Show my cuteness before I get this blood out of your eye. That's right. I'm finna go in. Don't need no pardons. Slow motion for me. Don't yeah. even throw no potion for me. Mm. Berserk, go and come out. I don't even know what else to do, but I know he's gonna shout. <laughs> It's almost like that's a lullaby to your death. Right? Lullaby, dude? <laughs> what is Boy just scrubbing? Yeah, he should have trained, man. So you notice that he never, like, just stays consistent with his training. I've got to get to Saber and Tosaka fast. But she probably set you all kind of booby traps. Right. What's that? Great, she's got a guard up there. <laughs> Yeah, I'll be scared. You never know when Hercules is gonna bust out screaming. Don't move! Damn. You picked the wrong house, fool! Saber. Right? <laughs> what are you doing here? I was about to ask you the same thing. You're in better shape than we expected. I suppose this means you really didn't need our help after all. That's what I said from the beginning. We were better off just leaving you to your fate. You guys are here too? I can't believe it. Because I asked them for their assistance. I had an incredibly strong feeling you'd been abducted by Eliasphere. And I agreed to come because we are more or less partners. Come on, let's get out of here before Eliasphere gets back. Stairway to hell! <laughs> That's the... The exit. It looks like we made it just in time. Yeah, I know. But it's the front entrance to the castle. Isn't this exactly where they'd expect us to escape from? Our enemy is not here, so our best plan of attack is to take the shortest route out of this place. All right, let's go. We'll see, man. I don't think Sometimes it's going to be that easy. She just had a good idea. Yeah, I was like, man, why would I just go right out the front? Hey, little bitch right here. Them Uggs on. What's wrong? You all are leaving so soon? <laughs> right! You just got here. I would have tried to go all around the back or something. Leave so, through the basement, the attic. Good evening. Now I don't have to go looking for you, Rin. Thank you. I didn't actually go anywhere. I was just having fun watching you guys run around the place like a bunch of idiots. <laughs> so the person you sent out your front door was a fake. Yeah. Oh, wow. Well, I'm the lady of the house. It's my job to attend to my guests' needs. So she got shadow clones and shit. Is he gonna come off the chandelier? Ooh. <laughs> Please stop it. How you gonna do the same thing and tell me to stop? Mine sounded better. I'm guessing no. I'm guessing Stop lying. Why can't you do that? But I'm not gonna lie, Archer, he got a whole point. He got a bad attitude, but he got a point. I mean, he don't be about the bullshit. He ain't finna waste time. Right. Deal with them be dumb. Archer can't take on Berserker by himself. Use his noble fantasy. That's the wisest course of action. If you can escape first, Rin, then I should be able to follow. Independent operations like this. Happened to be a specialty of the Archer class. Mm -mm. Let me he got it. Let me he got it. Got the Michael Jackson River the uh, time fan song. In the park on the beach, you want me in space? Mm. You're so much funnier than I thought, Rin. Listen closely. You aren't a person who fights. You're a person who creates. Clear everything else from your mind. There is only one thing you are capable of, so it's imperative that you master it. Archer. <laughs> Materialize. Never forget that what you should always be visualizing is you at your most powerful. You don't need external enemies. Your own worst enemy is the image you have of yourself in your head. 
Them some heavy words, Paul Blart. Seriously. Are you gonna destroy everything? Come on, hero! Yeah, he's kinda of blocking it off so y'all can escape. Archer. We'll see. Why are the archer is really annoyed right now? He had to go. Ooh. Got his jacket a little bit. I thought he cut his leg off. He had to come fight this battle because Shiro got himself captured because he is not that smart. Yeah. But I mean, he is a servant. He was going to have to fight eventually if he wanted to win. Hmm. Already cut. I touched every strike and still. Sounds like his slashes cover a lot of distance. Uh oh, is this a bow and arrow? Or is it another sword? Hmm. Got the yin yang swords. Got the yin yang twins, man. Let's go. Animation looking pretty crisp right now. Well, I want to see somebody knock that smile off her damn face. Mm. Come on, Please man. You said you're going to finish him off. What's, what's up, bro? I think he was giving Shiro that speech because he thought there was an idea that he, he he thought there was an inkling of a hint of a piece of a, you know, uh, that he might die. I couldn't figure out what I was trying to say, y'all. Did you really think a noble phantasm like that could be Berserker? I am the flesh and bone of my own sword. I am Batman. Ooh. Yes! Arrow, please. <laughs> Celestial arrow! We saw this coming. Blow that nigga face clean off. Ooh! Taste the rainbow. Well, he tasting it all right. I hope it tastes good to him. <laughs> what was that noise? I'm guessing that has to be Archer. Let's go. Oh, Zerker actually had to defend himself. Oh, wow. Yeah, they got him. Who exactly is this guy? It's like he's imagining noble phantasms. That would have killed any normal servant almost instantly. Mm. <laughs> well, I don't think he could have gone. I thought it would have been. They just bounced on this dude's head. Steal me loose through my body, and fire is what courses through my blood. Wow. I have created over a thousand blades. Okay, what is he setting up, though? What is this? Ooh. I thought he was gonna cut his head off. I did too. This nigga is acting a fool right he now. He is, but I don't want him to. I don't want him to be. Ooh. Nice. Did he just create some wings? No, those are swords. They look like wings. They do, but they do. Hey, this nigga posing with it? Epic fight. Cut his head off. Please get him. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. You've been Girl, talking Archer your did shit. Not to play. He's been talking the most shit, but he hey, he's backing it up. It's tough to get out of there. Oh shit. What is it? Search yeah. command mark disappearing. Well, not yet. It seems he's still putting up a fight. She lying. Mm -hmm. Trying to make it to where he doesn't worry and turn back around like a dumbass. So, do you still think it was wise to take on this fight? You never did have any mercy, did you, Ilya? Ilya? Well, he knows. It may be inevitable, but... You'll still have to work for it, Berserker. 
You can go easy on me if you want, but in the meantime, I'm gonna take two more of your lives! Two more of your lives? How many lives does he have? About ten of them things. Where is he? He might just want to disappear. Oh. Where'd he go? Oh, uh, the bat signal. They just dropped a beat like that. All right. Are you about to do a, a singing duet or something? I don't how, like how Berserker just kind of, he might be the most powerful, but he's like a mindless idiot. He just does whatever he's told. I mean, he's a servant. That's, that's supposed yeah, to Yeah, but he doesn't talk or anything. I call forth unlimited blade works. Unlimited blade works? I thought that was the name of a season. What's this? Shit, that, that next part must be about him. He really wanted to win this fight, huh? He wanted to do something. I wonder why he didn't just escape. Oh, I remember seeing this. Yeah, I remember that. This field. So you got all kind of weapons Can around him now. Or is this gonna be like a new finisher move or something? He's just gonna be grabbing all kind of swords, slashing them. As you can see, <laughs> what you face are unlimited blades, the pinnacle of weaponry. The animation look clean. Well, what are you waiting for? Yeah, let's go, man. Yeah. <laughs> Got the Virgil stance with it. He run up like Virgil from De Devil May Cry or something. Damn. You see all the crows and shit. Ah, <sighs> man. Well, you lost. Did he really? Elias Field will be coming after us soon. We've got to hurry. Hold on! I said hurry! What are you gonna do? If Seriously. If you killed by those two, I will never forgive you. <laughs> she looks so hopeless. Oh, wow. Save her! Ren, help me! Boy, Ren done helped enough. <laughs> Ren has literally helped you enough. Well, well, technically, he's not he? dead, though. That was five lives from just one servant. I still don't see how he was able to do that. It's unbelievable. I think I might be done for too, though. Did you, Berserker? Uh, do we look like he went easy? Wow. Man, he looks dumbfounded right now. He's like, fuck this dude, fuck me up. Wow. But guys, that was episode 14, <laughs> the end of the ideal, man. RIP my man Archer. Man, my boy Archer went in. He got down for his crown, bro. He did. He tried. If it hadn't been any if it was anybody but Berserker, he probably would have won. But yeah. I don't know. Um <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, this episode these last two episodes have made me hate Shiro even more. I hate to say it. I can't stand that dude. His ignorance of how the game works and his whole nicety nice attitude and oh, I can overcome the world and oh, we can be great. I mean, yeah, but there's rules yeah. and regulations. And when you don't follow those, you put everyone else at risk. And some type of way, he's found a way to now, you know, have to 
make Archer fight because, oh, God, he just. Yeah, he needs to get with the program, man. Like, watching Shiro do these things is like watching a person who's picked the character up in a video game, but they're not picking up the controller, and they're just getting their ass handed to them by the computer. <laughs> you know, that's all the way I can it's think like of. It's like person, watching a person run into a brick wall multiple times, even though you're telling them all you have to do is go around it. They're just going right into it every time. This is the way I think I can do it. Right. Like, um, come on now, bruh. You keep getting everyone else in trouble, yourself in trouble. <sighs> now... Archer is 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 gone, you know, and yeah, you know, it's it's weird, you know, because like we're seeing some of these different elements that kind of defy the laws of what is supposed to occur up in this universe. Like Archer, for some reason, he I think he had more than five lives, right? Or what's like he bypass the amount of lives that you're supposed to have because he lasted for a long while against the Berserker. He did. And, and there's more to that character. I was hoping that he would reveal who he was. Like, what I was his hoping name? he would reveal who he was. I was hoping he wouldn't be gone. But we're more than halfway through this series. Not series, but season. Or well, it's basically a series. series. We're more than halfway movie. through what we're doing right now. Uh, what we're watching right now. So, um, yeah. Yeah, man. But um, I got to go ahead and give that one an A+. Plus. I was going to give it an S. Oh, you going to give it an S? Yeah, I was, I'm giving it an S. I thought I was going to give it an S when Archer... Flew out the damn about flew was on the balcony, standing on the balcony rail, mm-hmm. and he was not trying to stop. I thought he was gonna cut Berserker's head off. I did too. I thought it was gonna lead up to like some kind of special attack where he just summons all the swords that he threw out. I like how he was uh, yeah. saying like these different quotes or these chants or whatever when he whenever yeah. he would do like a move. Same. You know, you know he was he was doing a damn thing, but yeah, that was a great one. Yeah, it was, man. But anyways, guys, we hope you enjoyed this reaction because we always have a blast reacting to these things for you and with you when you guys do watch us, especially on Patreon, which I think you should sign up for if you want to get these episodes weeks in advance before they air on YouTube. But yeah, if there's anything that we missed or something that we just got misconstrued, be sure to correct us and provide context in the comment section below. And also be sure to share us on different social media platforms, especially with people who love to watch Fate Stay Night reactions. With your mom. Yeah, with your mom. Share us. Have a nice three. No, but um, <laughs> this is your boy RBG, aka the Random Black Gamer. Here are my lovely wife, Jenna Lee, on the ones and twos. And this is We Ain't See the Reactions. We'll catch you guys on the next reaction too. Fake Stay Night 2006 edition. Peace. <laughs>